Hi, this is John McCormick at Albuquerque Homes Realty and AlbuquerqueHomes.com. Today I would like to show you how to create Google Maps. I like to build neighborhood profiles in my Active Rain blog, and within those profiles I like to implement a good Google Map. The other day I had a fellow Active Rain associate that asked me exactly how I do that, so I thought I'd take this opportunity to show you. First thing you want to do, obviously, is go to Google Maps. You can simply do a search on that, click on Google Maps, and your city should populate. If it doesn't, um, you, can, you can point it to your city. At this point, you're going to see Get Directions and My Places. Click on My Places. That will be your account. You can see that I have created some maps below here. At this point, you will want to click Create Map. We want to give it a, a title, in this case Bosque Del Rio. You want to give it a, uh, a good description, keyword rich, Google will appreciate that, and you'll want to make it public so that everybody can see it. Once that's done, come over here to your map, and then you want to drill down to the neighborhood that you're going to be focusing on. In my case, Bosque Del Rio is right here. Then come up to here to the three icons. The third one, you can drop that down. I choose to use a shape. So I click on draw shape and it's simply a matter of click, drag, click and drag to outline the border of your neighborhood. Once you finish, it shades it. You can then come in here and change the color of the shade to anything you wish. Now you can create a, a title and a description. I like to use uh, rich text so that we can create links and uh, different color fonts, etc. Go ahead and give it a title. And you'll see that as you're making these changes, it should also be changing over here. Okay. Now we drop into the description. I've already created some content for this. Save some time. So I've got the, the neighborhood name. This will become an IDX link for me so that I can show them actual homes for sale, uh, my website, my contact information, etc. Uh, simply click OK. It is populated over here. And you can also use this pin and you can place it in here for a part. It's another opportunity to uh, create some additional content. At this point, you want to come over here and hit Save, and Done. Then you can come in here and uh, use this link. This, this gives you the opportunity to capture the, uh, the direct link. You can create a short URL. You can email this, send it directly from here if you wish. Uh, and then you have the HTML uh, embedded that you want to embed into your site. This is a, a quirky thing with Google. You have to click this help button. It takes you to their page. I simply then back out of that. I come back into my places. I click on Bosque Del Rio. I then go back up in here to the link. And now you see that it's customized and preview embedded link. Once you click on that, then you have the opportunity of what size of map do you want. You know, you can go small, medium, large, or you can customize it to whatever you want. Uh, for most, most things, I either do a medium or large. At that point, um, you can come down here and simply capture your HTML code. Uh, go into your blog and paste that in, and it will show you the map. And that's exactly how things work. If you have any questions, feel free to uh, shoot me a note, and uh, make it a great day.